Hey, what's up, you guys? Today, I got a box that I'm very excited for. I know exactly what this is because it is the only product that is coming from the influx of BTS that is coming in November that I actually ordered from Big Hit Shop itself. You guys are already going to know what's in this box based off of the title, but before I get into this, I'm just going to tell you, um, a quick little hack to ordering on the Big Hit Shop if you had an issue getting shipping to the United States because it was an issue I came to when I was on the website on my computer when I was picking the country to ship this to. It wouldn't scroll down. So what I actually had to do was use my phone to order it, which is literally the same thing as ordering on the computer, just my phone let me scroll down to the US so I could get this. So with that out of the way, Let's get into this. Looks like they double bubble wrapped it. And I know some people have um, horror stories from ordering from Big Hit like with the packaging it came in, but honestly this came super quickly and I really had no issues with it. Like it looks fine to me. Pink is also my favorite color so it's the reason I bought it. <laughs> and this is the first DVD that I ever got for an artist that I follow. So I'm also just going to say one little quick little hack I do, because I see a lot of people use the, um, use scissors or box cutters to get cling wrap off, and if you're like me, that kind of gives me a little bit of anxiety, because I feel like you're going to ruin your product. So I just take one of the corners, and I kind of just move my thumb like this until the plastic wrap gets stretched so much that it breaks across it. It's a pretty simple little tool to use and you don't have to worry about ruining or cutting the box. So here's the front of the box. This is the Korean version. Here's the side and the back. And then here's the other side. The sides are the same. So does this slide out or how does this here we go? So this is the first DVD that I've bought for a group that I follow. And I figured since BTS is my alt group, I might as well go for it. Okay, so I think this is a photo book. Let's try to get everything out of here. They packed this really, really tightly in, actually. All right, hold on, let's see what we can do. I guess you're supposed to open it like that, because it has the pull thing here. And then, oh, I see what they did. Feel a bit special? Yes. <laughs> so let me pull everything out. And then, yeah, now everything came out a lot easier. So sorry. I'll put the box to the side. And I think what I'm going to do first is go into this part. I think this has the um, three discs in it. So here's the front, the side, and the back. Which this back is identical to this back. So there are three discs in here. Oh, I hate that sound. Here's the first one, it's yellow. Does anyone else hate the sound of having to pull CDs or DVDs out of plastic? Like, ugh. I hate it. I hate it so much. And then here's the white one, which is cute. I also did make a point of getting this set because I thought the concept was really cute that they did for it. So if you're wondering why I got it, that's why. So this also comes with a photo book. So here's the front of it, the side, and the back, which has imprints from 
my fingers already. Interesting. <laughs> Just gonna give us some more room over here so we can get into this. So it has a table of contents and the first section is open the memory cloud. Second is best memories. Third is called inside out. The fourth is called guardians of the army bomb. Kind of makes me think of guardians of the galaxy. The fifth is behind the stage. And then the f fourth, <laughs> fourth, wow, sixth. Can you guys tell that I kind of actually just woke up? It's called credit. <laughs> I'm super excited to have this. Since I got their um, membership kit with their first photo book, I've kind of been on a rampage of I need BTS photo books. Just because they all look so nice and cute. Jin looking sassy as usual. There's Hobie. I just realized there's a slight glare, but I think that you guys can still see the um, photo is fine. It is pretty gloomy out today, but I think the lighting right now is working okay, so that's also kind of a reason I was rushing to <coughs> I was rushing to film this. <laughs> Mr. Worldwide Handsome. It looks like he has a bunch of loofahs in this. And it also looks like someone is literally walking up to my front door. So you will probably hear the doorbell go off. Sorry about that. Woo! So we will look at those after we go through the whole photo book. So, oh, that's so cute. In their little pajamas. There's Tay. There are a ton of people walking around and I don't know why. Sorry, I get distracted really, really easily. If you guys haven't already figured that out from all my other videos, like... The amount I get distracted is ridiculous. Is you? <laughs> is he a carrot? That's interesting. He's probably not. So I'm guessing that they changed their pajamas they wore for each fan meeting. <laughs> He's so cute. If you also haven't realized, I have like the biggest soft spot for Jimin and there is my dog barking like crazy. Sorry about that. You're probably going to hear him in the background. Because he thinks it's his job to bark at every single car that goes around the block. This is a pretty packed photo book. You get a lot of pictures. I'd say I am pretty happy with this for as small as it is compared to their other one, the other one I got, which I just got the magazine and then the LI tour um, program one. It's smaller, but I think it has more or maybe about the same amount of pictures. So like I said, pink is my favorite color, and it makes me really happy that they're all wearing pink. So if you do hear background noise, um, my family is home and my brother is off from school. So it's probably going to be a little bit louder than usual. But I wanted to get this filmed before I went off to school today. Priorities, I know. <laughs> he looks so cute. So I do love how vibrant the pictures are. That's always nice in a book when the pictures are really vibrant. And the pages are, they're glossy, but they're also not like super glossy. Like they're not, they're kind of matte and glossy at the same time. If that makes sense, maybe it doesn't. 
I don't know, I'm not in this industry of making photo books for a living, but that's just how it feels. <laughs> it says Guardians of the Army Bomb. Oh, they have little clouds on their shirts. That's cute. This is behind the stage. So all of them getting ready to go out onto the stage, basically. Sorry, my hand got tired of holding this. <laughs> I have tiny hands, but I'll hold it. Struggle through it anyway. So, okay. So here's the last page, all of them bowing. Here's the credit page, and then the back page. It says, Happy Ever After. And here's the back of the photo book. I don't think I showed you guys the back. Did I? Here's the side. I don't remember. I already don't remember. Oh boy. So this does come with a postcard. Here's the back. And here's the front. It's a group one. They all look cute. And it also comes with a photo card. So this is the back of it. And if you have the, all the photo cards and you line them up, they make a picture of the group. And I got... <laughs> I pulled Chimin, which is kind of funny since he is definitely my second bias. I don't know if I'm going to try to trade him for Taehung or not. Like, I guess I should put foreshadowing. Um, she is. <laughs> so, there's your answer. Yeah, I will probably tr try to trade him for Taehung just because he is my bias. And... So I do have the Japanese version on the way as well, um, another photo book for them, and then their Japanese single that they just released, or are going to release soon. So it was kind of going to be a BTS full month a little bit there, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. <laughs> watching this. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed my unboxing, and if you have any questions, I'll gladly answer them. Thank you so much for supporting me, and I hope you enjoyed.